It was a chilly one last night, that's for sure. But if you stayed up to look outside, you probably saw the super blood wolf moon. This photo is awesome. Sent in to us by Debbie Kazi out of Pompano Beach. Thank you for this. It was beautiful last night. And then now it's beautiful this morning with the sun rays just beginning to peak over the horizon. Live view out of Fort Lauderdale's tower cam and temperatures in Fort Lauderdale. 45 degrees, 47 Miami, 60 in Key West. Taking a wider view of South Florida temperatures, a lot of 40s, so it is a cold start. Plus, we have winds out of the north around 5 to up to 15 miles per hour at times this morning. So it's going to feel a little bit cooler on the skin. The wind chill gives us a temperature reading of the lower 40s for Broward and Miami Dade, maybe even the upper 30s for the inland temperature. So it definitely feels cold outside. Bundle up, and we have high pressure control. So we're going to stay dry for today. Nice and clear skies across much of Florida. Meanwhile, this high is centered over the Tennessee Valley, bringing down that cold air mass, dangerously cold temperatures across the northeast where those feel like temperatures or the wind chills are going to be down to minus 30 for us. We're not getting out of the 60s today. A little warmer tomorrow, especially with an east wind returning by tomorrow. And that's going to bring back more cloud cover for Tuesday and the chance for a few passing showers. Not today, though. Uh, we're going to stay sunny but cool with the temperature only reaching the mid 60s for that daytime high. Voters, it's choppy out there this morning. The seas two to four feet, up to six feet over the Gulf Stream. By tonight, we stay in the 60s. So the warm up is back clearly. Uh, still nice and cool cool to wake up to the highs tomorrow 72 and then even warmer as we head towards midweek but Keep in mind, we're going to have a lot of cloud cover, breezy conditions, and some gusty showers on Wednesday. And then the next cold front arrives. Thursday night, we cool down into the upper 50s for Friday morning.